Hey, see you around sometime, all right? All right. Have a good cool. one. Be safe. Sure. All right. Cool bike. I like that one. Have I never seen that one? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> actually, I own uh, two other ones, actually. Really? Yeah, they're on the mini and the, and the mini step through. Uh, so I got like three. So, so you're, the, you're the local distributor. No, I'm just, <laughs> <laughs> I just they're so cheap, you know. Yeah. So, <laughs> all right, I'll see you around sometime. All right. All right. That was really interesting. That was like the uh, first time, not the first time, this is kind of like the, the second time I've seen uh, someone with a, a red power bike. But that's the first time I've seen someone with a red wagon. Older gentleman, as you saw, I was talking to him. I don't know what he does. It sounds like he does consulting or multi-level marketing or speech coach, sales pitch coach or something. Anyways, I'm off. So that was, that was interesting. The red mini, or not the red mini, the uh, the uh, red wagon four, I think. I think it's a Red Wagon 4. It's really small. Oh my gosh. Uh, it's, it's definitely smaller than the Red Rover. Uh, smaller than the Red City. The smaller wheels really, really make it small. Anyways, that's that's kind of cool. I got I got to see someone, uh, another Red Power Bikes owner. And ironically, the guy's from California, he moved here. It sounds like he moved here recently. It sounds like he moved here recently from California. Anyways, time for me to go home. I enjoyed that rest. I had a, the, the clubhouse is open. The Coric machine is available. So uh, I might, I might, next time I go, I might take some hot chocolate with me and uh, enjoy myself. Really beautiful day out here though. Nice and cool. Bright and sunny. No snow. Woo! Not snowing, not too cold. Good enough for me to ride a bike. Did a little uh, shortcut there. I'm gonna go under. I'm gonna go into the uh, tunnel here soon enough. Be going into the tunnel here. Tunnel 
time. All right, you've probably seen this. Very familiar. Maybe I'll do a barrel roll here. to the intersection. Um, Where's to this car? All right, waiting for this car. Uh, I think I gotta, let me stop. I think one of my cameras just stopped for some reason. I don't know why. Uh, I gotta bend down for all this stuff. Uh, where, where can I go? Let me just stop right here. My chest mount died on me. Uh, maybe it's low on batteries. I didn't bring another battery. I didn't bring a charger. I was just gonna ride and go. So let's just keep going. Uh, I'll use that throttle, go up on the barks, the tree barks. All right, or the tree roots. All right. Sorry if I've been quiet. I've just been just enjoying the weather and enjoying the ride. Guy with the headphones on. Okay. All right. I still got only one bar missing. I've got four bars remaining. So. A lot of room, a lot of power left over. All right, brakes sound good. Oh, water spray. Ugh. Ugh. Why would they? Oh, gotta do my little jump. Let's do a little jump. All right, that was fun. Uh, why would they have water spraying during the middle of the day here? Ridiculous. It was forecasted to rain. I think I'm low on batteries on my chest mount, so I've got no chest mount right now. Oh well, it is what it is. Then again, my uh, my Insta 361's batteries uh, or the cameras are dying out slowly but surely. Or it just could be low on battery. Probably is low on the battery. All right, going to the construction site. I might do some off-roading. Why not? That was some good exercise. I met someone new. I didn't get the guy's name. Didn't ask for it. Looks like he was in a meeting. I think he's a sales coach or something or multi-level marketing. The only type of people you meet out there during the weekday are people who are into multi-level marketing, insurance salesmen, like, I don't know, insurance salesmen, because they work for themselves, you know, independent contractors, so to speak, IBC, whatever you want to call them. 
slow down. Okay. Hi, delivery pickup. They they own a laundry cleaning service out here. Cut through the field. Slow down. Let's slow down here because uh, I don't want to. I don't want to flip my bike again, break my hand. Oh, look at this. What do they do? They built a on ramp, some kind of on ramp for boats, maybe. I don't know if I'll take my kayak through the levee system here, but if I wanted to, I could, I guess. Probably not, but I could. Uh, enjoying the uh, wonderful fall season. Fall is like the best out here in Houston. The bugs go away, it's cooler, the humidity drops. It's like the, it's like summer up north. sound really good. They don't make any noise. All right. That's good for me. I like that. All right. Home sweet home. Let's go home. my mouth out at the bathroom in the sink. Took a little bit of sink water too, drink, but uh, man, my mouth is so dry. That was almost like, it was like cotton mouth, you know, like, you know how you, you smoke weed and then you get cotton mouth? It was kind of like that. That guy in the van over there, just checking out my bike. So yeah, I, had, I was getting cotton mouth just from the dryness of the air. I'm not used to having the air so dry out here. Chest mount just turned off, which is all right, I guess. I don't know. I might, I might have to. I might have to go into 360x all the way for these cameras now. So, anyways, it is what it is. Nothing I can do about it. Technology keeps moving forward. That's all I have to say. so fast. It's about noonish, probably a little bit afternoon. I like going out during the noon. Get a lot of it's warmer. It's the warmest, which is 70 today. But you get better lighting for the camera. Pro tip, better lighting for the camera.
just enjoying the ride. Hopefully all of you will enjoy the ride as well. Enjoy, have fun. If you recently got your bikes, ride them if you can before it gets too cold. Alright, looks like I got a merge left here. Checking if there's anybody behind me here. One, one more car. All right. Seeing a lot of monarch, monarch uh, butterflies around here. They must be migrating down south. It's that time of year. Oh, I feel a lot better. I got burnt. I got the blood circulating through me. I'm all, I'm all warmed up. I, when I left out uh, from the house, I felt a little. I felt tired. Jeez. I feel winded. I have cotton mouth, dry mouth. I'm getting dry mouth right now, but uh, I'll be home soon. Right hand signal to. I mean, uh, bearing down, but I'm going to keep my pedal assist five. Uh, take the shortcut. Uh, oh yeah. Suspension seat post. Oh, thank God for the suspension seat post. That's all I gotta see. It's just throttle. Oh, it smells like laundry. Someone's drying their laundry. It has that fresh scented smell to it. Squirrel! 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 I see a lot of squirrels now. Oh yeah, I'm just throttling. Um, down three bars now with the throttle. If I let off the throttle, I got three bars. Using the throttle, I get two bars. Yeah, two bars remaining. Three bars missing, which is fine. It doesn't seem like it's windy, but maybe it's just the cold air, you know, pushing up against the cold air so I can feel that wind. Home sweet home. Please like, share, like, share, comment. Hope you all enjoy this video. I'll be writing some more during the winter. Oh yeah. All right, gear down. Pedal assist down. Oh, coming in hot. Coming in hot. Coming in hot. All right. Oh, let's talk. Dock the bike, docking bike, and ah, oh, mission completed. Nice. Anyways, everyone, thanks for watching. See you next time.